Hi, this is the formula block. The formula block allows you to make complex operations with values inside Landbar, like you would do on other platforms like Google Spreadsheets or Excel and store the result in an outcome variable. Whereas before you could only transform data with JavaScript or with external APIs, now you'll be able to do it easily using formulas. There are four important sections in the block that you should know about. First, we have the output variable. This is where your result is going to be stored. Next, we have the block outputs. We know that there are two possible outputs that will follow the green or red path. But here you can choose the outputs that fit your needs. Success error for mathematical operations. True false for types of formula in which the outcome is a boolean value. Or custom where you can use specific results as custom outputs. Subsequently, we have the formula itself. Here is where you write the operation you want the block to deliver. If you start typing the formula, the autocomplete function will help you. Also, when you type an existing variable, you can choose it from the list. Something that is quite awesome is that you can easily see the result of the output variable here. And even add test values, so you don't have to try the whole bot to see if it works or not. Following, we have the formula browser or documentation. Here, you have all the necessary information for the different methods and operations you can use in formulas. With formulas, you can use fixed variables, use landbot variables, write formulas inside formulas, use the same output variable in the formula, Obviously better if it's already created and settled from before. Formulas can also be chained one after the other. And a recommendation. Formulas also work great with condition blocks. But there are some things we have to be aware of. For it to be a valid formula, it has to have the blue tick marked. Make sure that the output variable is in the right format. If it's a math operation, it should be a number and not a string. It's also important to keep in mind that true and false are strings that start with capital letters. Also, when you write a formula, it has to start with a capital letter. Additionally, if you're using Landbot system variables like add today, add quotation marks between those variables. Same with non-created variables. And that's basically it.